What's up, Cardano fam? Ada gang, we got some exciting updates, news for Cardano. So hit that subscribe, hit that like. Links to everything is always in the description. Let's start with input output. The upcoming Ouroboros Genesis release marks a significant milestone in the journey towards full peer to peer node operations. Markin Marson, apologize for mispronouncing the name, and Leon Leonard recently shared insights on why this release is crucial and what SBOs, exchanges, and community members should prepare for. Automatic peer discovery and selection, dynamic adjustment to changing network conditions, innovative use of blockchain provided information, utilization of stake distribution for overlay network construction, introduction of, of eclipse evasion avoidance capabilities. Now, this is a lot of jargon, I'm not a developer. But one thing that this sends to my intuition is robustness. Let's go ahead and have a listen. What a fantastic beard this guy has, by the way. Yo, beards are making a comeback, huh? It's all about the beard. Beard gang, where are you at? The node will automatically find new peers, select them to deliver the best performance for the network and adjust itself to the changing conditions. We also uh, put a groundbreaking design in the blockchain ecosystem, how to rely on the information that blockchain provides. For us, it's the stake distribution that is secured by the consensus algorithm. So every node can actually trust it. And we're using that information to, to construct the overlay network. It also provides Eclipse evasion avoidance capabilities for, for Cardano, which is something that hasn't been seen yet on, on other blockchains. Don't mind if I do. I mean, hey, I, look, <laughs> that sounds good to me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That sounds good to me. That sounds good to me. I mean, hey, hey, nice little touch, the blue uh, the blue shirt. I like this a lot, bro. I'm hearing. This is, uh, this is great. So I think I missed one guy here, which is a Samuel. So my bad there. But hey, like... This is uh, this is exciting to me. I feel like Cardano was quiet, 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 and then bangers just come out. And it becomes scapegoated. I know people are like, there's no users, there's no this. But guys, sometimes TVL metrics are a meme too. Like there's more than what meets the eye. And I think Cardano has been moving with this narrative, the slow moving tortoise, like turtoise, turtle, slow moving, you know? And peer review, meticulous, robustness, um, the stuff we hear about Supernode and everything else, like it just has so many good for going for it. I don't see a future where Cardano can't perform good because yes, the community is not as big as the others. Yes, the active wallets are not as active as the others. Doesn't have as many, but it is going with slow and steady growth. And I think that is the key with longevity. It has such good brand intimacy. That is good for an agnostic approach that's globally adopted. So I definitely see in my eyes, I could be so wrong. Let me know what you guys think. Is ADA shitcoin is a great... I believe ADA is one of the best altcoins. And I'm definitely going to be scooping up some more if I see it go underneath the 40 cents a US floor. Look at all these potential Cardano D reps. And again, it goes to show that like Cardano is not just a meme. There are people building on it. There are people utilizing it. There is an active community. Charles is so active as a YouTuber. Mad respect for. Not a lot of people ever do that but also super active on Twitter. He's not super stingy like some of these guys that are never active. He shares memes, he memes himself. I like that. I like a leader who is charismatic and willing to be vulnerable and to like have fun, you know what I'm saying? Because this crypto space gets a little uh, dull and dry. But that's it for the Cardano news, guys. Not a whole lot going on on Twitter from what I see for Cardano. This is really a big juicy uh, Pi. I'm going to keep an eye on Lace. Lace is still with their 1.1 wallet. Have you guys used Lace wallet at all? It's, it's for the first time I've been very excited uh, what has been delivered by these guys in terms of a fantastic wallet. MetaMask was great. Phantom wallet excited me. And then Lace wallet, I think for the first time is like a nice looking one. So this is sick, guys. What do you think about this? This groundbreaking design. To me, it seems like it's going to make it more robust, more capable, more secure. And uh, if you guys are a developer, feel free to, to speak your mind. Let, let us know your two cents. Hit that subscribe. Hit that like. Guys, Cardano, I think, is going to have a very excellent future. 
Uh, taking a look at CoinGecko, let's go ahead and take a quick glance at the price. Taking a look at one year, right? It's chilling right now and it went a little below this 46 cent. But uh, I've been scooping up in these ranges. So for me, my buying window is like the 24 cent to like these 40 cents. This is Black Friday sale for me. This is Black Friday sale. Uh, anything like to me in this 45 cent range is kind of like semi Black Friday sale. It's like a flash sale. But guys, watch my video about the FUD campaign that has begun that I predicted that it's true because every day they release like four or five hit pieces on crypto. And so we could see more downside, not just on Cardano, but the whole space. It's not isolating Cardano, but we could see more pushed back down so that they load up the trebuchet, they load up the catapult for what's coming in Q4 because summer has never really been uh, very fruitful for crypto. Summer and crypto just don't get along. I don't know why, they just don't. Here is the summer of 2022. We look at the summer of 2023, we're, we're, we're summer of 2023, same thing, like 29K. We go here, summer, right, in the 9K. It's just it's just one of those things that summer, I don't know what it is, but it's like, it's like Q4, Q1 loves crypto. I don't know why. So in my opinion, cycles happen, the narratives suit the cycle. So I'm optimistic on ADA. I think ADA can easily surpass a dollar and beyond. I'm conservative, but I don't like to give crazy price predictions. Let me know, guys, what is your price prediction for Cardano? Do you love it? Do you hate it? And why? I will see you guys in the next Angry Crypto Show.